if you have a contour map of your site, it will actually be nice to draw these lines, lines to guide you where you can place or add points and place different elevations so that when you create a topography within Revit, you're going to have a nice sloping site. So in this case, you'll see that this particular contour map is only two-dimensional. We don't see a elevation, right? But if you have a drawing like this AutoCAD example file, right, with the contour maps and the uh, elevations, right, or different elevations, then that will translate easily within Revit. So you're just going to add or use this and those lines or points uh, based on the layers that you're using will now be uh, added and the points along the contour line will be placed. So you'll have a similar contour elevation here and then maybe going up or down, right? I think this is going up, right? So it might be, you know, one meter up. So there'll be points placed along this line and so on and so forth, right? So using or creating a contour map with varying elevation already within AutoCAD will help in uh, creating a realistic contour map of your site.